You know what? I might need my phone too. Yeah. Woo! We're gonna go around the Fisher Towers. Yeah. But we probably won't make it all the way. All right, here we go. <laughs> I can go in front if you want. No, um, whatever that thing is that you're saying. Crop. What is it? Crop dusting, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, that's my stretching routine. Okay. Did you see it? That was it. No, that was it. You saw it. <laughs> yeah, I was like that. That's how I stretch. That's how I stretch. I'm stretching right now. <laughs> and my warm up run looks a lot like my normal run. It's kind of funny. Hello. 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 think can't remember left to right here in there not down there let's go this way huh this way Woo! By the way, my uh, friend Matt, you may have heard of him. We... Oh yeah, so I have this friend from friends in kindergarten. He's an anesthesiologist. And uh, we... we have a film production company called Awesomely Hardcore Productions, where we do really stupid things and videotape it because, you know. No. <laughs> we don't even edit our films, that's how bad we are. <laughs> Oh, uh, the stupider the better. Like, we take lots of B-roll footage of like clicking into boots and putting on gloves, and then like skiing mediocre groomers. Part of what makes it such a great film company. Someday I'll have to get it all put together and actually start a YouTube channel. Right, like, I can relate to those guys. I've skied a blue run like that before. <laughs> wow, look at this. Amazing. Yep, love this run. Yes, yes, this is exactly how we would do it. Look, I'm trail running. tower we were just up there I didn't tweak my ankle this time I'm already ahead of the game I have a feeling not too many climbers what? Oh. We're not running uphill because there's only two options on this run, uphill or downhill. When we run it in reverse, 
this part will be downhill. Just look forward to that, you'll see it in a few minutes. It rained yesterday. It snowed a little bit this morning. We're not really figuring on seeing any climbers today. I'm adding some commentary for Yoshi. I'm sure she'll watch this every weekend for at least the next decade. Actually, I'm counting on it. There's a good chance I'll sink into a deep depression if Yoshi doesn't watch this every weekend for the next decade. That is only 520 viewings, Yoshi, if you wanted the map on that. Here's the valley. Our camp somewhere over there somewhere. Oh, I forgot to start my watch, man. This is a total chump run. This doesn't count yet. So far, we've now made it a hundredth of a mile on the trail. It seems like we've been running longer than that. <laughs> Except for dropping off the fin. And we're like at the height of the fin now. It's cool though, we'll wrap around the back side of the towers. Just for the record, Kat's run a longer distance more recently than I have, so she's winning. She's got the half marathon in her. <laughs> Go, Kat. Go, Kat. Beginning of the season for Kat means she's already run a half marathon. Beginning of the season for Mr. Neutzel or Mark means he's run nine miles. <laughs> and it's been a slow build up to that. Hey, look, downhill. Woo, jogging. We're approaching this in true trail run fashion. Which not actually having hung out with any trail runners actually don't know what true trail run fashion is. But hey, I look like one. Selfie running, I'm gonna trip and die. Oops, almost missed the trail. It's a good thing these naturally occurring Karens are along the trail. They just take tens to just decades, many, many decades to, to grow. We're almost coming around the formation and we'll be under the wall soon. Yoshi, I think I can see you from here. You're out there by that building. That looks like you. You're painting something, I, I don't know. <laughs> oh, look at that wall.
in case you didn't know, the trail's this way, straight up that. Cat. You got Castleton and the Priesthood nuns in the background. Yay. Rocking it. Stop it. it. Yoshi, if you know any history of the Fisher Towers and climbing or whatever, if you could insert that into the video right now, that'd be appreciated. In case you were wondering if it was tall, it looks like this. Yeah, it's big. Just take that in for a sec. I know. The gummy bear, not so gummy bearish from this side. I think that was a lie. I don't know. I've always been told though to respect my guides and what they say. So, there it is. Desert paintbrush over here. Already in bloom. What? what? Good looking stuff. In case you didn't catch Cat's quote there, that was wow because that's what this is. This is pretty spectacular. I haven't heard any climbers yet, not surprised. Curious if anyone's ever stood on top of that thing. The weird squiggle shape, double nosed. Uh, I bet some climber has tried. I bet a climber has tried. 
This thing's pretty immense. Looks really muddy. I'm gonna take a pass on climbing that today. I totally could though. I'd solo that. Alex has got nothing on me. Just adds to the excitement. Oh yeah, there's a waterfall. My zoom feature doesn't work while we're already recording, so. Some other towers down there. Hello. Good to go, cat. All right, we're off again. Sort of done. We'll pretend this part's downhill. We'll be good that way. Hello. Hi, uh, thanks. Hello. Thanks. Thanks. All right, sun's out, gun's out. Is that what we're doing? Cat, is it warm enough for suns out, guns out? Apparently this trail run is not like super tough because there's kids on the trail. I don't know. Another naturally grown cairn. That just got big again. There's a contrail up there, it's the government trying to kill us. Stop telling the truth, cat. Embrace the conspiracy theories. <laughs> These are angry snowflakes. <laughs> That's the trail we just ran. What? Mind blown. In case you didn't hear that cat is informing us all that contrail snowflakes have eight points and are capable of killing countless humans. Watch out for those contrails. Cats going suns out, guns out. Might be time. Oh, I gotta get through the mud first. Dink, 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 dink. That was a 5 9 mud crossing. This may be the best part of the film right here when I pull the sweatshirt off over the GoPro. Oh, enjoy some mud for a second, and boom! Uh, in case you're wondering what we're standing beneath, it looks like that. There's my buddy Alex, who I'm gonna catch up with about halfway up. Hey, 
Hey, Alex. I'm feeling quite, I don't know what came after millennials, the tech generation, whatever. Because if I don't record this, I didn't do it. But I'm gonna avoid the uh, selfie at the edge. It's my game plan for today. That's right. I have an Insta now. I've never put anything on it. That's. I am the lamest person I know because I don't do anything. We just rounded the end of the fin. It's gonna be shady back here. Might need to put the guns away. So the sun's not out, you don't need your guns out. Wow. This is pretty. Just in case you were wondering, Yoshi, uh, this makes Kat and I professional runners. Even though we're on our break, we're still getting paid. You are a professional artist, but we already knew that. There's a ladder. <laughs> This, this is, that's right, it's part of the running trail. I'm gonna do this one-handed because that makes sense. Why don't I love it? It's strapped to me. Oh. You're gonna watch me walk down the ladder. Look, there's an up close to the rock. Yeah. That's right. Here, I'm gonna blow on the camera so you can feel the 40. Although it's not windy back here, it's actually dead calm, so, you know. This is slightly faked, sorry. <laughs> On the way back, you can tape and have a great commentary for you. It's gonna be awesome. Our film, sorry, there's no tape in this camera. Oh, yeah. I am fully zoomed out, and uh, it's like, I mean, it's an awesome and cool clouds. BT dubs. Yeah. Okay, Yoshi, go ahead. Woo -woo. Going where no man has ever gone before. Just ignore all the footprints on the ground, okay? <laughs> the wild desert mountain sheep goat roams these places like nobody's business.
This is just a reminder if I die, Giselle gets the silver box. Make her dreams come true. I don't know who gets the rest of my stuff, but Giselle gets my uh, silver box. Wow, look at this shelter made by Native Americans many, many, many years ago. Thousands. Maybe even eons, whatever that is. And look at this beautiful spot to uh, sit in a wash that would flood with rains in the shelter with your children. Hopefully they're big enough to swim. <laughs> I feel like this run is mostly uphill at this point. But we all know what that means. Downhill on the way back. What? Welcome to Utah. <laughs> exactly. Welcome to Utah. Did you think that climb was over? Just kidding, it keeps going. And it probably gets steeper. Cause Utah is not spelled E-A-S-Y. I painted this thousands of years ago. There's no lies in this narrative. We should probably actually turn back. We're at time. We're at 28 and a half minutes. Okay. And I told uh, Blue Crab we'd be back in an hour and a half. So, you want to film it? Yeah. All right. So you get to see Mark. I might not have as much of a, an awesome commentary because I probably will have to save my breath. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Witness the speedy Mark. Woo -woo -woo -woo. Sweet. Well, how do you record and watch the thing at the same time? What's it? <laughs> okay. Yeah, let me figure this out. Okay, cool. Yeah. There we go. Cool. Not gonna watch. It might be horrible footage, <laughs> but we'll see. That's right. <laughs> Gonna have to watch it start to finish. <laughs> no matter if it's just the ground. <laughs> you can see all the rocks along the way. Alright. 
<laughs> so while you're on your elliptical Yoshi, you're actually not at home, not at the gym. You're right here, Fisher Towers. <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh -oh. Whoa. Oh, really? Uh, oh, and this is a climb. <laughs> Big bro, actually. Woohoo! That's <laughs> right. Woohoo! <laughs> How did you make it down there just along the side? Oh, okay. I'm gonna have to switch. <laughs> Adventure. Adventure. Whoop, back on land. Yeah, here it is. The lotto. And the mighty mark. Ma magic mark. <laughs> Running. This is a nice section. <laughs> oh.
Where's the best line? Yeah, I dare that group. I've climbed so long. <laughs> this big climb up. <laughs> nice. The dino just caught it with one finger. God. <laughs> Drop. <laughs> Woo. Yeah. Killian Jarrett doing one of his rest day glide jogs just to stretch out his muscles. He does one rest day on average every month and a half, two months. Yeah. Oh, good. How about these 45? <laughs> He's on a very strict plan. He has to still beat the Everest speed record. Next month, he'll give it his 50 second attempt. 
Ah, uh, yeah. Starting to get used to the high altitude. <laughs> Many, many. <laughs> You're using a lot of feet. Mark Nutzel was here. That's a distance running, yeah. Mark Nutzel helped Yeah. Yeah. Mark. Now, if you follow Mark Nutzel's training plan, you might get there with Forrest Gump, but. Mount Everest, you know, it's still a challenge. My people got really close to it though. Yeah, he was very close. <laughs> or a mountain in that area. But hey, just being near Mount Everest, you know, felt so real. It's just so real. Yeah. Yeah. It's running right there on the same planet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Incredible experience. <laughs> yes. Rock. No, like up there. Almost as much as up there. Almost. Yeah. You can feel the rock under your feet. You can see the snow. Breathe in the fresh mountain air. Yeah. Acclimating you know, to the freezing temp temperatures. And there's some salt, very similar to Everest, the Himalayan <laughs> salt. Yeah, man, pretty much we're there right now. <laughs> That's right. There are not many trees here. Not many trees. Just like a tree. Yeah, it's challenging. Yeah. Could have done that. Yeah. Can't mess around. Gotta watch your trail. Gotta watch where you step. I think the one big difference between here and Everest is on Everest, I don't get lost in the descent. I'm gonna leave breadcrumbs behind. Oh yeah. <laughs> you can just <laughs> Yeah. Snack <laughs> on. The croutons might be a little dangerous, yeah. Yeah, you probably that's that's a big temptation. <laughs> Killian has fruits. <laughs> you should start a company like a running snack, like a mountain climbing snack. <laughs> Killian's curtains. <laughs> 
the Killian Crouton. Perfect for every Mount Everest climb and other climb and other runs. He'd be a million millionaire, billionaire. Yeah. Just gotta, gotta have that one million dollar idea. And you know it's gonna work. That's when I always come up with my million dollar ideas on my runs, on rest day, rest day runs. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. You have to spell the, the croutons with a K though. <laughs> Killians. Killer croutons. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> now it'll be more of a reference to the, the Mount Everest experience. Yeah. You know. Uh, oh yeah. Is there little cubes that be little triangles? <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. You're gonna have to have it like dusted in some kind of like powdered sugar or something. Oh yeah, Parmesan cheese. Yeah. Perfect. That'd be a what? Oh yeah, <laughs> and you know instead of parmesan like milk, cow's cheese is gonna be yak, <laughs> yak cheese, yak parmesan, <laughs> and a little prayer flag, like a little miniature prayer flag that you can have with you in your pocket. <laughs> You two can have a great Instagram post. <laughs> it's not on Instagram. <laughs> Didn't happen. <laughs> and that'll be the tagline. <laughs> Hashtag. <laughs> Killian's killer croutons. <laughs> or just... The crouton. The one and only. You can tell me what the meaning of life is. I will know that you've watched the entire video, and I might give you a nickel. Ooh, you're gonna get rich. A nickel for every bag <laughs> of croutons sold. Yeah, we'll go in Yoshi's pocket, but only if she asks for it, because she's watched the whole video. <laughs> And I've seen the sales pitch, the, the advertisement. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. 
at all those rocks. Just like Everest. Only what? 2 Killian. Woo! Yeah! yeah Killian, Whoa. Killian, Killian, Killian. Yeah! For the win! Woo! Woo. Nice! 